The sanitizers spray booths at Kencom in Nairobi Central Business District. This is part of the 50 booths that have come into the country that will be set across different parts of the city to help keep our city safe. The social distance proving a challenge as city residents scramble to have a feel of the capital's new initiative and get disinfected from coronavirus. The spraying cubicles would disinfect at least three people all in one go. According to the Ministry of Health, Nairobi takes the lead in confirmed cases in the country. The sanitizer spray booths are expected to be spread to estates within the city. We are targeting all the major bus stations that we have in the city center. Uh, as of last night, uh, the booths were also installed in Kibra and many other parts across uh, Eastlands. So our intention is to reach out to as many of those places where we have huge populations of our residents. A move welcomed by city residents. Mitandio ziko na watu wengi. Hili watu wazidi kufaidika. Ukiona maramara si moja watu wa mitani ndi wanakuangu wakijikusanyika. So wakipata kitu kama hii wakipita ndani watakuwa kwa sawa na wat affect sana na COVID-19. Meanwhile, a private cleaning agency has embarked on fumigation exercise in Mombasa police stations with an aim to disinfect the public places. Coast Cleaners and Gardeners Chief Executive Officer Dixon Wawero said police are among the most vulnerable groups and thus need to enhance their safety during the COVID-19 pandemic. Kuna watu wengine ambao wamefanya kazi zao pengine usiku na mchana amekuja ku report hapa hawajua me meet na kina nani. So pale kwa polisi panakuja na kila aina watu na wengine wanatoka hata kwenye county zingine tofauti tofauti. Mombasa is one of the regions with confirmed coronavirus cases and reported deaths. Nairobi County becomes the second to launch sanitization booths after Mombasa. This as the country unites towards the fight against COVID-19. Many are hopeful that the pandemic will come to an end sooner rather than later. Irene Mchuma Odim, Channel One in the county of Nairobi.